plug top, she doesn't push it top, right? I feel that clever, man. I be rapping. Recite my little brother, young bro, also nigga. Fuck with either of us, oh, I throw you pawn the river. Hold holes in your chest so you can breathe easy. If my song's the most violent, and I guess the world needs me. Cause that will never be peace, like Pot said. In this one, the largest flesh pop X again. Regardless of my label name, I don't make rock for rock bread. I make big bread, big bread around the clock bread. I see red dots, it's not a pimple. I pop heads, I ain't talking about burning pimples when I say I. I got high legs. You see, Cloud Rap was gangsta off songs. But we are the gangs all alone. Back, I'm looking strong. 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 But me, I've been gangsta all alone. Matter of fact, I'm the gangsta on the throne. You fake gangsters need to go home. The first verse was hard, and second verse is hard. She need the chest of torch, and I'm grown name with organ. Snap at Lieutenant State Trooper and the Sergeant. If you violate my circumference, all with no search warrant for Rock for rock, big like the Chambers Brothers. Locking down shit, the creeps on the chain of brothers. Tell us how to talk, how to walk, and change us, brothers. Fuck who don't like who saw, I remain in the gutter. If you church a family member, think my rise is busy, you ain't gonna make my mama rich bitch, so mind your business. I'm starting to fly with pigeons on the boat, my competition. Ain't there a click, you used to fuck with my mistakes. Bitch, nigga, get your gold care, go get out that, out that apple bottom, get your gold care, look. You're saying, saying, y'all get this acting like whole ass stuff, down on down on the next man, cause your flow bad, but get this.
That ball further out there. I hate taking balls. Shit sucks. And the Lions will take over. First and 10 at their own 34 yard line. Whoa. 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 From the 34 now, here's first and 10. here on the first down run and that'll make it second and six well the end of all that hitting and hollering, and it was a four yard run so the offense gonna go back to huddle feel pretty good about themselves defensively you have to feel okay because you didn't let it turn into a bigger run but the goal shut it down for two yards or less that's when you start to feel good about yourselves that's what you're going to need to do against in the game receivers. you got to get in there and get physical with them that time he got in close got in tight it's the, the fat bastard. Just too much. So I got the small yellows. Like a retarded bus. Out of the gun. They'll look to throw. This is Johnson. He's got it. And he is going to have a Lions first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. First down. The drive stays alive. A third down gain of eight. And a minimal gain here as he's up to at the 47-yard line. Oh, that's a real nice job there by the defensive front. They just Bumped engaged the and Oops. held their ground. But how about the guy who made the play? We have to talk about whether they take a good first Mercedes. step or not. Many times you just don't take any step. Just get your feet moving, get your body going. And then once he made the read, he was able to make the play. A four receiver look here. Three out to the left, one to the right on second and eight. <coughs> On the hit, but they'll say it's incomplete. Johnson, the intended target, and it's third down. Pressure, and that's certainly going to be a key to this game going forward. And that time, they were able to get in there and influence the throw. Remember, quarterbacks got to get rid of it. They don't have the tough rule that they can fall back on anymore. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. play fake he'll look to throw in a double coverage and it's intercepted picked off by the safety jar come on tart man you gotta get there tart coverage as a rookie qb what lesson can you learn there well understand this you saw zone in college and the defensive backs reacted but they don't react like they do on this level so when they're in zone and they see the ball coming to them they'll react at least a half a second faster You've got to know where you want to go with the ball and be decisive with it. Otherwise, the end result can be something you don't like. Now the first play of the drive there is incomplete. And to put it mildly, this is a tough spot defensively. They have to come right back out and defend their red zone. But how about that good first step towards forcing them to settle for at least three points? I think they're also thinking bigger right now. Imagine being able to stop them totally and change the momentum. After the incomplete pass, here now is second and ten. Oh, Jesus Christ, y'all. What fucking bullshit, man? He's had a fantastic rookie season, made a lot of lovely throws. Swear, he is luckiest fucking breaks ever. I mean, with the year he's having, a lot easier for he and his teammates to accept that. Because for the most part, what they've seen, it's been pretty Here I am playing legitimate defense. And he was just getting picked for no fucking reason. 
You have nothing to deserve that. Bullshit. Now a handoff here to his running back. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. They'll wind up losing three. And now it's third down. Sometimes you just sit back and marvel at what he can do defensively. Speed, strength, quickness. He's the whole package. And that package just wrapped up the runner for a loss. have an extra defensive back on the field. A nickel set for third down. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. And that's going to be incomplete. The contact there enough to jar that ball free. And it brings up fourth down. It looks like a second empty possession to start the game. It's certainly not the way you want to start when you come in off of a loss last week. Every team talks about starting fast. They're hoping on their next possession, it can be a delayed fast start and get them going. The offense is not leaving the field. They're going to stay out and go for it on fourth and three. They'll try and throw for it here. And it is incomplete. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out. And the Niners take over in terrific field position. I mean, he did every whip and the key to his house. This is Monster. And some space here. What the fuck y'all doing holding over there, bro? Not playing. No aggressive nothing. Like, shit, I might as well. The guys just gave up that play. Back to throw. And the Lions pressure too strong. Let this bitch ass thing off. Off the edge, huh? Into the backfield. They were able to win last week despite him being sacked four times. They might need to tighten the reins a little bit, or this one may not end in another victory. You're right about that. They can't count on just winning the game no matter what happens. They can't let the accumulation of hits and harassment in the pocket get to their quarterback. Got to stop that, get him clean lanes, and throw the football in order to have a better chance to win again this week. So after the sack, a scenario you certainly don't work on too often. Yeah, throw another pick here. They just do get the playoff as he'll look to throw. He's gonna fire one deep over the middle. And that's gonna be in. Oh try. God damn it. A nice throw, bruh. Nice throw. Hello. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. They'll drop to throw. That's incomplete. Whatever. But there is a flag down, so hang Not on. about to throw a pick like you want me to, man. Now, just fine trying to fuck me over. The you have to get outside of that tackle to tackle box, right? Get out there and then you can do it legally, but he wasn't able to do so. They end up losing down as well. First kick, 47. This one looks good as well. Making me a fucking ball up. Following a 42 yard punt. And the offense will take over with a new set of downs. Senior line. So here's a first and ten now down inside the 20. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. Yes, sir. 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 Brings up second and seven. Here's a second and seven. He will 
being chased down the line. Can't the receiver the place brought down. That one, the protection just went 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 down. Jack Fox out to punt here on fourth down. And just a single punt for him in the loss last week as he sends this one away. The Niners take over first down chance at their own 45-yard line. Send on one whack, no. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. We've seen both of these offenses still sort of in that figuring things out phase, but I suspect some action on the scoreboard soon as they start out here first. Look, you would have dropped that one, boy. I swear I'd have traded your ass. You've been dropping shit all season. Just drop it. You ain't been yakking up nothing. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Probably take your X factor away, shit. I got the baddest hoe with me, but I'm a pass. Fast forward, now you see me on your plasma screen. Bitch, I'm big CEO, shyster, no checking me, what you mean? They go play action here on first down. I just I don't be knowing about those cutoffs. Like, that was nice work there. Nigga, the nigga's open. He's open. And I, I throw it. And the sun is nigga gets. Oh, they get such a speed. And not allowing that turnover to hurt. And second and ten, he'll look to throw again. Eluding the pressure right. That's complete to Moster out of the backfield. Face mask. Taken down by the face mask, it appeared. And yes, out come the flags. Well, we looked at each other right away. We knew that. And I got all out. of this cheese. I can't even enjoy it. Yeah, damn, I'm ready to blow it. But you caused the blood. You did. Hey, suck my dick! Suck my dick! That's what I'm talking about right there! That's that fucking bullshit, man! Second interception for him now here in this first half. And you gotta think he's a rookie, Charles. How much does confidence start to become a factor? I think that's a great question because that's what they're gonna check on when he gets to the sidelines. The coach is gonna check on his really want me to fuck lose the game. Handing dumb shit out like this. That's weak. That shit is weak. It wasn't even a user. So AI hey, got that much brain brain out like her? Come on, man. Fuck. Thrown in the red zone last time. We'll see if they can rebound. I 
guys have to think the last thing he said is they went back out there was, don't do that again. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? Yeah, I think that. I think that not only did he say that, but he also yeah, told yeah, us that the end yeah. is supposed to be in. Yeah, right? Baby the girl, I got stains in my drawers. Get the fucking five balls. Sipping on champagne. Everything else will flow from there. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Like a train. Give me a brain. You ride with two eyes closed. You're a sniper guy. Damn, if he didn't get hit. Thank God that other dude. Pay attention. In a bit, camera breaks it on her neck. Coming up, they got eight yards there. That's a really nice job by them picking up the run blitz and detecting it and blocking it and turning it into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage, and they're easily blocked and turned to the side. <laughs> They'll go to the air here on third and two. And he'll find his man on the outside. I got a good one here. I'm going to get it the best way. I know how I won't let you down. The hook up there and it's a first down. I won't let you down. Let you down. I won't let you down. Some money cause I'm a hustler and some money Everything is gonna run And days a week and 24 hours a day That ain't enough for me so I ain't wasting time so I'm just Come to sleepers in my life ain't getting cheaper So you know them dollars I stay on my mind type of a game considering the blitz that they just had against them Hey, come on, boy, you got to, I need to move out of you right there. Something take his mind off. That. Coming up to the line, and they will need to run another play here before the two minute warning. All right, take his mind off. Pass interference. Here we go. Let's see who this is on. So they will accept the penalty and move forward. Take it. <laughs> Watch her of all things. Yeah. Fucking yeah. watch her. Woo, they go watch him. Boy, that nigga watch it. Him out of our life, y'all. Get that dude out of our life right there. Set up 
Hurry. Life. That dude out of our life sometimes. Fuck him out. Ooh, man. Y'all know y'all be fucking me over this whole game. Fuck you. Fuck EA. Fuck this game. Fucking bullshit. Fucking big damn near two whole fucking quarters to fucking score. Should have been goddamn score. Should have scored off that pick. Y'all out here giving the Lions free beats. Giving them free interceptions. Oh, no, no, no. And now there's still more than a minute to go in what's been a tight game. You figure we'll try to see them move the ball downfield. And remember, they get the kickoff to start the second half. So this is a golden opportunity for them to go down there and put up a couple of sixes. Yeah, you might be able to get a two for one. That, none of that. A well executed 22 yard game. Time. I'm a burger, 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 I'm a burger
Oh no, don't hit him like that. Hey, take his fucking head off coming through there. He'll give it up. Give it up. Promise you. I just gonna be changing the climate. She like the way I be vibing. To be frank, they gotta feel pretty grateful to be in the ball game. I would agree with you totally because they've done all nothing offensively in this game, yet they still find themselves in a position on this drive. And they can't find anywhere to go with it, and he goes down. Well, so much for setting the tone of the drive offensively. Giving up a big sack that loses that kind of yardage, not a great start. So now 20 yards to go on second down after the sack. Work to be done. Now the throw here complete on the right sideline. And he takes us beyond the 35 before going out of bounds. Hey, that was yardage that they needed there after the sack on first down. They didn't get all of it back. But now they look at third down as a manageable situation. Whether they have a much better chance of picking up. Out of the gun now on third down. Running back, it's complete. And a pretty nice tackle there, ranging up from his free safety spot as he'll stop him about a yard short. One hallmark of good defenses is understanding the game, understanding positioning, and tackling immediately in the secondary after catches. I think we just saw that on display right there. Got to him before he ever had a chance to think about turning it upfield. And how about this one now? In their own territory, a gutsy call. They're going to go for this on fourth and a yard. He'll try to run for it. And he brings this up to the 46. Good enough for the first. A big roll of the dice on fourth and one, but it pays off. They convert. On first down, he'll drop the throw. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And he's going to be taken down right at the line. No gain on the screen there at second down. That's a simple throw and catch, but even with that completion, zero yards gained, so they're behind schedule on down and distance. I think they were hoping to get it to him. He can make a man or two miss, but that window closed quickly. Now he'll look to throw here on second and ten. That's taken in by Callaway. Whatever. Whatever. Antonio Callaway, his fourth touchdown on the year. And the Lions have taken the lead. Pretty good response. They had given up the touchdown and the lead, but they struck back. And I love the way that they just saw it happen. Took a quick exhale on the sidelines. So let's go get it back and fast. Let's go ahead and throw the ball downfield and get our own six points. A huge jump play to regain that lead. Take it right, out seven no yards deep, and it'll come out to the 25. He will not attempt to return. Never been that like it's 420. I'm disoriented. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. Good drive last time. Really effective passing the football. Do you maybe mix it up now? Go to the ground game and surprise the defense a little bit. I would anticipate the defense. Make He's got it with the 15. If your arm is just a little stronger, man. You can get that out there. Oh, wait. Like you should be able to. 62 yards. Only way I can force that bitch out there, though. A real field Run. flipper there is all of a sudden they've got a first down in the red zone. They hand it off to Mostert. No, no, no. If y'all watching this game, I hope y'all seeing this crazy, crazy shit. That dude Ben dove. I moved when he dove, and somehow he followed me mid air while he's diving. They're gonna look to throw, and this 
this one incomplete. Too much contact to hold on to that one, and it's third down. You get the sense that they're saying, we're not playing up to what we're capable of, and we're deep enough into the game that the early jitters are long gone, that they should now have some sense of continuity and be able to make some of these plays that they have not been doing so far. In need of a conversion on third down. They had a big play to start the drive. Not much sense. They dropped a throw. And it's complete. In the end zone. Touchdown for the Niners. George Kittle, his fifth touchdown now on the year. And once again, the 49ers are back out in front. And that makes it 14-10. Good. Makes the score Niners 14, Lions 10. Here is Wisnowski to boot it away following the touchdown. And my chicks keep bitch. They irk in my nerves. Fields it in the middle of the end zone. Yep, we got one. Kick, pick it up. No! Come on! Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, y'all. Defensively, Jimmy Ward in on the stop. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. And he'll get about three as he takes this up near the 25. It's a gain of three. And this is third on play action. Now throw. Thank you, Richard Sherman. Finally! That's what you were supposed to do earlier! Fuck! Thank you! God damn! Show weak ass off the field doing that stupid dance. Oh god, and he gave it up. He caught me mid juke. Fuck. God damn it. You see? Hey, they want me to lose, bro. I swear to god. I swear to god. It's like. Oh, no way. Come on, y'all. Get that shit together right there, bro. Beautiful throw. We just gonna cough it up, huh? Nigga. Just gonna cough that motherfucker up. Was the key to winning games. They can't believe what they're seeing right now. Because they spend all this time on it with the fundamentals. Taking care of it, tucking it away. And they're not doing it. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. 15 yards is the pick. Yeah, let's keep starting very nicely. First down. They'll keep it on the ground. Control. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right at a yard. It's a gain of nine. Brings up second and a yard. Second and one. Throw left side complete. That's James. Complete. And he'll go down here at the 35-yard line. Gain of three. When the offense reads blitz, doesn't matter where it's coming from, tight ends know that they become a big part of the passing game because they should be an easy outlet when all those extra bodies are trying to get to the quarterback. A hot route, so to speak. Back now here in Santa Clara. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. It's the Lions trailing, but with possession of the football as we get set to bring you the fourth quarter. And he'll have a gain of three to the 33. The tackle by Eric Armstead. 33 yard line. Looking to throw. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. Oh no, he lost There we the go. Give it right back. Because I don't know what that white boy is doing. 
toting that fucking rock. You don't you have no fucking white boy back there toting a motherfucking rock. Yeah, because a lot of the time we just blame mm-hmm. the offensive players for not taking care of it. How about the effort of the defensive players? No, that is white ass, dude. And if they're good, yeah. anticipate the contact coming and try and cover up the football. And they still find ways to knock it free. Now throwing here to start the drive as they connect left side. And yeah, they're going to have this across midfield. <laughs> <laughs> catch and run going to wind up netting him 33. Oh, shit. Oh shit. Come on, big Lazard. God, I hope you hit me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was it. It was tough, that motherfucker. Good pick. I couldn't float that bitch back there. Good pick. That was a stupid pass. Knew he ain't had the arm strength to get it back there. Especially with you lurking right there. But there's a lot of knowledge to be gleaned every time you throw an interception if you do things the right way. And hasn't there been a pretty darn good quarterback along the way who put a lot of interceptions early, learned from them, and became great later? Who would that be? That'd be one Peyton Manning through 28 his rookie year. That's the NFL record. How things turn out for him? I think okay. He's cool. in commercials now. Yeah, I think he's doing okay. Clock running under four to play now as they come up on first and ten. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. And he'll push this forward only to about the 42-yard line. Greenball credited him with a one-yard gain there to make it second and nine. Brings up second and nine. That's a 42-yard line. <laughs> <laughs> Turning point. Big play coming. This is third and long. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. God damn, that's my fault. I gave that up. I was so fucking out of position. Damn, bro. Touchdown now on the year. And the Lions are once again going to retake the lead. As a fan, is there anything prettier than a well-executed post round? Yeah, that a thing of beauty. Ooh, it. Uh. Done like that for a touchdown. Uh, the throw, the catch, and how about the run after to get it to the end zone? The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. He's got out the boat with my partner. He told me he need three. I told him I Field it in the end zone. And not willing to risk it. Oh, you are fumbling. You've been fumbling. It's a touchdown. I like him. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. And they will be looking to answer the touchdown. Their defense just surrendered. Still a good chunk of time remaining here in the fourth quarter. And a chance to regain the lead in the table. A gain of three and second down. Back to throw here. Hey. Trying to knock him out the frame. Trying to go clap something. Like she off something. 
recently, Justin Coleman had a little bit of frustration there. Back-to-back -back incompletions, receivers blanketed on both attempts, this time on third down. One score down, here we go. They're going to go for it here on fourth down. As expected, they're going for it to keep the drive alive. Wow. It's incomplete. The Niners go for it, but it doesn't work out. And the Lions will get the football back in terrific field position. No, I don't start shit. We saw a number of good games earlier today. This will be top of all of those. It's been a dandy as we come up on first and ten. They'll try and run some clock here as they keep it on the ground. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. He was brought down by three points separating these two sides with two minutes left to go in the fourth. So the Lions in possession of the football as we welcome you back. They've got a second down now as they search for a way to get this one to the finish line. Ooh, I got to kill him. Come on, son. This stage of the game is they stop it behind the line. And now we'll see a timeout used on defense as they stop it right out of the break with 1.57 to go in the ball game. Escaping the pressure right. And look at this. Oh, no. Why did you do that? Bruh, I'm pretty sure that nigga roughed that pass. The AI did. You see what I mean when I tell you Destin lose, bruh. Did everything right. Now Johnson. Trying to turn the corner, but they string him out and stop him at the line of scrimmage. The tackle there by Richard Sherman. Bruh, every time, bruh, man, I, man, I did everything right. I played a good game, bruh. Like, that, that, I can't control that, dog. Cannot control that. Nigga, just, mm. San Francisco will call their second timeout as they'll get it with just a shade under a minute to go in the game. And on third down, a nickel formation here defensively. down at about the six and now the Niners gonna signal for their third and final timeout as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds left to go in the game mm -hmm. I was out of position bro that shit killed me was one time this game, I was out of position. So here comes a veteran that shit killed. A that shit hurt. Yeah, you right. A 23-yard attempt. Oh, sneaky motherfucker. Wait for it. Glad I was in that other shit. See what this nigga arm got. Oh, boy, ain't got no time else either. Why y'all not hiding that ball? Hey, that's been a story for him all season, bruh. Hey, it might be time for him to go. Kittle might be on the block. I'm gonna see what the cap penalty is, cause nigga, <laughs> you ain't been yakking him up. Gonna drop everything. He's back to throw. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. Oh, that's it. They ain't got no arm for that, man. And it's a terrific return here. Not without no timeouts. Oh, shit. Right at about the six yard line. Good game. He's got a feel for him right Same, now. Four man. interceptions, and you can almost see through his face mask. There's a lot going on in between the ears. There certainly is, and probably way too much, because now he's probably doubting himself a little bit, wondering what it 
adjustments he has to make, but here's what he needs to do. Get through this game, go to the press conference, meet it head on, and show your teammates you're ready to shoulder what happened today, and you'll be ready for the next game. And if he can do that as a rookie, that's a great sign of maturity. So this one's over. It's a win for the Detroit Lions, and they were really helped by their defense, forcing three turnovers. I think what we saw in this one, today's defense. And what I mean by that is in the old days, pitching shutouts was big time. That was paramount. But the big thing was holding people down, holding down their yardage, right? Don't let them throw the ball through the air and gain a lot of... But now... It's about taking the ball away, taking away possessions, getting the ball back for their offense. They had three takeaways in this one, and it led them to victory. So for Detroit, they move back over 500 at 7-6, and six, and they will head home next week to take on the Seattle Seahawks. Meanwhile, for the Niners, they can ill afford to drop too many more as they fall to 7-6 and six on the year. And they'll look to regroup next week as they head to L.A. to take on the Rams. That'll do it for us. I'm Brandon Gordon, alongside Charles Davis. Thanks to our entire crew as well. We'll talk to you next time. So long, everybody. Wait a minute.